now that you've won at 205, push away the whole 185 talk? Well, I mean, the, the thing is, like, you know, uh, 205 is my home. And, uh, you know, if, if an opportunity comes at me at 185 and it, it's a good opportunity, but for the most part, uh, I feel good at 205 and I, I can't. Uh, it's hard for me to leave 205 weight class. You know, I would love to get a shot at John Jones again. I would love to get back to uh, where I was and, and where I can be, you know, as far as, uh, you know, going out there and just, you know, just being spectacular uh, every single fight. With the whole situation with the contract, where do you see yourself uh, with the next organization? Um, I go where the fans want me, you know. I, wherever, uh, you know, Dana and Lorenzo want me to be with the UFC, then, hey, then I'm, you know, I'll be knocking on Cain Velasquez's door or whoever the champ is, at, you know, when I'm knocking on it. I respect Roy. Roy. Roy has a great chin, hits hard, has great wrestling, great jiu-jitsu. Um, you know, he was a man about this contract. Like I told you the guys the other day, his contract was up in July. We asked for an extension. He said no. He doesn't have to say yes. I, 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 his contract's up. It's up. We, we got to get him a fight before the contract's over. We did. He stepped up. He took the fight. And uh, do Roy and I always see eye to eye? No, we don't. Um, but, uh, you know, we made an offer to Roy. And we'll sit down and talk to him again after this.